Competitive advantage. Plankton attempts an imitating Krabby Patty. In the sixth episode, Plankton attempts to break the entry barriers in the business world that have prevented him from competing against the Krusty Krab. He steals the Krabby Patty formula from Mr. Krabs so that he can replicate the famous Krabby Patties and eliminate the competitive advantage that the Krusty Krab has over the Chum Bucket. Despite his best efforts, Plankton learns that the Krabby Patties are non-substitutable and difficult. Curses, it's not fair. Mick Krabs is being interviewed by Perch Perkins, and I've never, ever had one customer. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Karen, my computer wife, if only I could have managed to steal the secret to Krabs, says I could have the formula for the Krabby Patty. Oh, he imagines grabbing the secret recipe and misses. No! Then people would line up to eat at my restaurant. Lord knows I've tried. I've exhausted every evil plan in my filing cabinet from A to Y. Don't get worked up again, Plankton. I just mopped the floors. What about Z? Oh boy. Z? W X Y Z. Plan Z. Here it is, just like you said. Oh, oh, oh. It's evil. It's diabolical. <laughs> It's lemon scented. This plan Z can't possibly fail. So enjoy today, Mr. Krabs, because by tomorrow I have the formula. Then everyone will eat the chum bucket and I will rule the world. All hell plankton. All hell plankton. Squish. Oh, 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 not in something. Oh, someone. You tweet. I'm ready. Promotion. I'm ready. I'm ready. Promotion. Oh, I think I stepped on something. Skrrr. Oh, sorry, Plankton. Are you on your way to the grand opening ceremony? No, I am not on my way to the grand opening ceremony. I'm busy planning to rule the world. <laughs> well, good luck with that. I'm ready. Promotion. I'm ready. Promotion. Stupid kid. One hour later. Evil Plan Z is working perfectly. Nothing can stop me now. Now that Mr. Krabs is frozen, I can steal the secret Krabby Patty formula. Perch Perkin here with an incredible news flash. Plankton is selling Krabby Patties here out of the chum bucket. How is this possible? Let's find out. Excuse me, Plankton. Perch Perkins, Bikini Bottom News. Can I get a minute? Step right up. Plenty for everybody. Anything for you, Perch. All of Bikini Bottom wants to know, how did you get the Krabby Patty? Well, Perch, before my dear friend Eugene Krabs was frozen by King Neptune, mm, I'm sorry, <laughs> he confided me in a secret wish, sell the Krabby Patty in my absence at the Chum Bucket. He said, don't let the flame die out. <laughs> by the way, act now and you get a free Chum Bucket, Bucket Helmet, with every purchase. Here you go, Perch. Some people have no taste in headgear. Morning. Huh? Babies too. Excuse me, miss, but where is everyone getting that horrid headwear? Oh, well I got at the chum bucket. Plank is giving them away free with every Krabby Patty. So you're selling Krabby Patties? Eh, Plankton? That's right, Squidward. And there's a free bucket helmet with every purchase. Care for one? No, you may have hoodwinked everyone else in the backwater town. But you can't fool me. I listen to public radio. What's that supposed to mean? It means you set up Mr. Krabby. You stole the crown so nothing would freeze him and you could finally get your stubby little paws on the Krabby Patty formula. It was you all along, but you made one fatal mistake. You messed with my paycheck. Me? You? Do you think this is funny? In a cosmic sort of way, yes. Well, Mr. Funny Man, is this how you get your kicks? Squidward! In this episode of SpongeBob SquarePants, we see several of the topics covered in Chapter 4 applied to the plot. Plankton has long been stunted economically by entry barriers in the food service industry. Plankton is desperate to flip the tables on the Krusty Krab and gain the competitive advantage that the Krusty Krab has over the Chum Bucket, more specifically the secret formula for the Krabby Patty. A competitive advantage is what makes a business product or service superior to all of its customers' other choices. The Krabby Patty is used to symbolize rarity in this episode because there is no other patty like it and it cannot be replicated. 
if similar firms control similar valuable resources and capabilities, then they are not rare. Squidward of Southwest Plankton savage all his plankton and scrappy patties, showing us that the Krusty Krab and its patties are non-substitutable. Tangible resources and capabilities that are valuable and rare can often be imitated, but intangible resources and capabilities are more difficult to imitate. Tactic knowledge, for example, can be very hard to imitate, not to mention the social aspect of a business such as reputation, trust, friendship, and a firm's culture and teamwork. The secret Krabby Patty formula is an intangible resource that is very difficult to imitate since only Mr. Krabs knows the recipe and keeps it locked in a safe in his office. Additionally, Plankton cannot imitate the Krusty Krabs reputation or the teamwork Spongebob and Squidward have fostered.